Which one of these worthy finalists gets to spend five grand on their project at Staples? Find out next on All Together Now. The winner of uh, our first uh, of many uh, That Was Easy competitions, Kyle Frias, Brad Henkel for Youth Together. And there you have it, the winner of the very first That Was Easy competition, Kyle Fries, along with his partner. Kyle is with us today from Dallas. Congratulations on the big win, Kyle. Thank you. So uh, for those who didn't have a chance to watch our last program, tell us a bit about the project that you spearheaded that enabled you to win this big prize. Well, to summarize it, it's uh, basically uh, in my hometown, uh, Plano, Texas, we... Uh, we try to stimulate uh, youth community service, so we go to uh, the student councils at elementary schools and middle schools and we provide programs for the students to actually run themselves and try to get, like, create it, not create it, but like make it organized and actually run it and donate money and work with the programs and help raise money for different programs for homeless children or critically ill children. So it really sounds like you're basically trying to help organize people at the school level, going from school to school and, and, and student council to student council to try to kind of get them organized so they can go out and do, do things on their own? Correct. I, I kind of see myself as a middleman. I'm just trying to create more of it because there, there's always going to be community service, but I've, I feel like I'm trying to just create a bridge between the, the potential community service helpers like the students and the actual programs that need help. How did you and your partner first get involved in, in creating this, and, and, and how did you first find out about this competition? Uh, well, creating the program, uh, it's kind of slowly happened over three years. It, it started off really slow, but then as things picked up, we started adding more and more programs because it, it, it seemed like such a good idea, and it grew a lot. And uh, we, we just applied for the Staples thing. Didn't think we, we didn't think we were going to win or even be part of the top five, but it turned out really great. That's right. It sure did. So how long ago did you start your initiative? Uh, it was in 2003. And, and, and how old are you now? I'm just curious. I'm 18. 18. So you were basically 14 years old when you put this together. Correct. That's pretty impressive. Very good stuff. Congratulations. Uh, pretty, Thank you. pretty makes me feel good hearing about a story like that. And Kyle, as we mentioned, you won a five thousand dollars shopping spree. This wasn't just for you, right? This was for your for your organization. Correct. All right, we're yeah. going to take a look at. Uh, we actually sent a crew out to shoot your shopping spree. So let's take a look at how it went. On uh, behalf of Staples, I just wanted to congratulate you for winning the Staples. Uh, that was easy competition, and um, pretty nice to have somebody in this local area that does the things that you do, helping out uh, our, you know, society. So, uh, so it's really wonderful to have you here today. And I just wanted to give you uh, your five thousand dollar gift card, and uh, let's get you a shopping cart. Get everything started. Does that sound good? All right. Mm -hmm. So I get 20% off, even more than the three, as many as I Yeah, it, if you are. bulk up to, say you buy like 12 attachments, say it's 20% yeah. off those 12 attachments. It's not just three. Really? Yeah. All right, then I guess I'll get that too. Okay. That's pretty cool. $2,855.76. 
Well, it looked like a pretty good day there, Kyle. Although, okay, I got one question for you. You, you had a $5,000 budget, and I think the total there was 2800 something. What happened? You couldn't spend all $5,000? Oh no! Is I I thought it'd be easy, but it's a lot of money. You ever see the movie Brewster's Millions? I'm oh, sure you have. So. You're too young. I don't the know, guy's got to spend a million dollars in a day. Long oh, story. Yeah. You wouldn't have made I know it. A movie. Well, well let, me, let me ask you this. Seriously, I mean, this is a pretty cool thing for you to win this. You're obviously spending this money from Staples to build your business. Where where do you want to go with this nonprofit? Where, where, what's, what are your goals with this? Well, uh, we have a strong base here in, in Plano, and uh, I'm going to college next year, so that's why I got the laptop, because I want to I continue running it in Plano, because there's such a strong base, but I'll have to have other people uh, actually organize it more than I can, because I'll be over in college, uh, so I'll have to be able to send emails out, and that's why I got the laptop, and I'll, I also got a printer faxer to... Just uh, the pamphlets and flyers that I create, I can also just fax them to people instead of printing them out. And Absolutely. Technology is a beautiful thing. All right. Well, Kyle, yes. stay with us for a second. We're going to take a quick break. I want to come back and talk more about Youth Venture and the programs that and the organizations uh, that it supports. And we're going to have the president of Youth Venture, Roy Gamsey, with us in just a minute. But we're going to take a quick break. You're watching All Together now. Stay with us.